behind the wall! Clem, hurry! out there. Good work, Clem. Shit. Okay. Okay, we gotta do something, y'all. Get down here. Can't just sit here and let this guy take pot shots at us until he runs out of ammo. So quit talking about it and do it. Yeah. Yeah, all right. This don't have to get any worse than it already is. You can just go. English, motherfucker! I kill every one of you! If I could just get over to that side of the wall, I could maybe get an angle on this guy. Cover me, alright? Just shoot over towards the woods. Yeah, okay. Good, good. I just need the distraction. Okay? Alright, I'm not going. Safe to come out. Here, I got him. Jesus Christ. That was, uh... That was intense. I thought... Man, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Thanks. For coming back. I didn't know this man. I've never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way. That didn't deserve it. Tried to pretend he was a walker. But it's different. I didn't think it would be. He deserved it. He was trying to kill us. Yeah. That's why I did it, but it felt wrong. Come on. Okay. How did this happen? She turned. Don't you go blaming yourself, Kenny. You did what you had to, to protect the boy. She just lost too much blood. Ain't nobody's fault. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She's with Alvin now. Yeah, yeah, she is. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. 
You rest easy. You piece of shit! Ugh. Hey, hey! Stop! Guys! Get guys, off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is. Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us. Kenny, his his sister is dead. He's lost enough already. You don't have to do this. Is it his house? Food? Please. Please, I can take you. Bullshit! No, no. It's true. We have place. Not far. Food. See? He wants to help. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us, huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. And if it's a trap, we'll all be dead. I... I think we can trust him. He wants to live as much as we do. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this! You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place! Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Don't blame her for what these people did. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to tie this shit bird up. Yeah, I got something. Follow me, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I... I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good, but I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me, despite everything I've seen, everything I've been through. I'm not pissed. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. That's... that's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. And it'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me the whole time. Wouldn't want it to be annoying. No. That would suck. I'm gonna try to make this work. All I can do is... Promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm all sore. I'm worried about Kenny. He's... He's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. That he's lost. It's changing him. He'll be okay. I've known him a while. Well, it's all starting to pile up. It's weighing on him. Everyone has a breaking point. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. I'll do my best. I know. Come on, slow pokes! Wait, we need to stop. No, no, I'm, I'm fine. Hey, I just need a second. Sorry, I just, I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen, you understand? Kenny, come on. There's no need for that. 
He's getting what he deserves. I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. If you know what's good for you. Kenny! He understands. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Go on and talk to him. I got clam if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Okay. What is it with you guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. And it all ends the same way. But don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches too. Do You're I? You're just scared. That's when it happens. When they don't know what to do. <sighs> yeah, that makes sense to me. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. Don't worry, you're gonna be okay. How did we get here? We walked. At least most of us did. You basically had to be carried. Sitting in the snow, leaning up against a tree, bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead, for no good reason, and I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with, just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin and Becca, Carlos, Sarah, and for what? You can't blame yourself. It wasn't your fault. No, not completely. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right, this should work. That's perfect. What'd I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know. Cleaning, mostly. I'm trying to guess how far this place is. I'd like to get off this leg sooner than later. Yeah, <sighs> nothing important. Okay, you don't gotta tell me if you don't want to. I'm fine. Hey, Clem, go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. Okay. That a girl. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. Go on. You can do it. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. Huh, yeah. I like it. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. What do you, uh, got there? Cause I think I'm alright. I mentioned it earlier. Can I change your bandages? You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. 
Let's get it over with. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. It's okay. I trust you. So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals? I'm glad Carver's dead. We saw to that, didn't we? So, I'm guessing this is gonna be the shitty part. Don't be a baby. We already got one. <laughs> Yeah, we do. Holy fucking hell! You need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. But man, does that smart. He can hear a few bad words. I've heard plenty. Yeah, that shouldn't have been the case. You were right about me giving myself up. I can't believe I was willing to sacrifice Alvin just to hold out a little longer. We should have saved him sooner. Got him out of the camp. I'm gonna think about that. Every time I look at Alvin Jr. here... Alvin should be here, raising this boy. It should be him. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Let's head out. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit! Arvo, we're not trying to be mean to you. We just want to know if this is where the supplies are. Is this the place you're taking us? Are the supplies here? No, it's at the house. It's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. Luke needs a break. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want, okay? But I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there, where there's a fence. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. 
Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. It's okay. It's okay. You're a natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got them. Come on over. It's safe. Today's my birthday. Here as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. Did get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and while it being your birthday and all, figure... This is as good a time as any. I'd like a sip. I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No! Oh, what's a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. I feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. I can take it. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just... don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. Guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey! Alright, all right, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, that 
That is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I'd come back for you. You know what I mean. Well, thank you, Clem. I do the same. Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. Sorry about your sister. Leave me alone, please. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. It's probably been a while for everyone. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know. Why? Because you made it with Luke? What does that even mean? What's the it? You know. Yeah. Because I made it with Luke. It's not a big deal. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? Wanna sit? It's okay. Um, sure. <laughs> you okay? Uh-oh, busted. I better take that back. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Did you ever get caught? Yeah. The problem with glass is it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy 
needs a drink more than any of us. Time to not make it weird. Want to sit here? No, that's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. I asked you not to drink. Girl your age, it ain't right. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to disappoint you. You're not, hun. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. It's a nice night. Just, uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there. After Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You... you really hurt my feelings. I did my best, and... I know. I was just... in darkness. And you showed up... with some light. But I thought I needed to stay there... a little longer. When I should've went with you. Okay. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Katja's face. I miss Doug too. He was a good friend. And I haven't had too many of them. He was a good boy. Pure. Just wanted folks to be happy, that's all. Boy like that. Thrown into a world like this. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. You should come too. I don't know. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. Yeah, okay. I miss TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. 